and looking for furniture deals here at Costco for January 2023, we have the True Innovations Paxley Fabric Swivel Glider Recliner, and it does everything. It swivels, it rocks, it glides, and you got the welting on the cushions here, which keeps it nice and firm and in shape. So this seasonal item, which they just got in, already has the Death Star on it, $429.99. So keep your eye on this one and see if they start to reduce the price on it, maybe the next ad cycle. Okay, now that all the Christmas stuff got cleared out of here a couple of days before Christmas, you can see they brought in the Thomasville Tisdale six-piece fabric modular or sectional. Now we've had this in here before. So this is $1,999. It's not on sale yet. So don't buy it yet until you see the price drop on this. Usually you'll see it drop about $200 or so and sometimes even more. And here you have the Synergy Home Arnie Leather Power Recliner. This is nice because it's really compact, but yet it's very nice feel to this leather. It's not too high of a grade that it would get damaged easily. Whenever you see it embossed like this with that texture, you know it's gonna last for you. And it's a rocking one. I I like the fact that it rocks too and there's all your controls right there now these were just put in a couple of days ago so they're seven hundred dollars but i'm willing to bet these drop fifty or a hundred dollars when they go on sale so if you want to score one of these i would say just give it a month or so and see if maybe in the next ad cycle we start to see some deals on these now here's a nice thomasville three-piece fabric chair and accent table set kind of looks a little old and stuffy to me like maybe something you'd see at brits carlton our older folks might like this and that is not a bad deal at five hundred dollars but you know what i always say Hey folks, don't ever buy furniture as soon as it lands on the floor here at Costco because you're going to pay the most amount of money. Wait until it goes on sale. At first glance, I thought this was a regular chair, but this is the Synergy Home Tegan Fabric Pushback Recliner. So everything, I guess, is mechanical on it. It looks very comfy, and I like the fact that it has the welting around the pillows there and around the, the seat here. So there's your welting. That makes it a little more firm and kind of holds its shape better. So this fabric recliner is $350. Now back when my girls were little girls and I used to go buy the bunk beds, I wish they had had these at Costco, but they don't. I love this intricate design here and uh, routed out here in the wood. These are solid wood. And this is the Universal Broadmoor Wingate twin over full bunk bed. So you have a twin bunk bed over here over the full size bed and I love that because normally you see a twin over twin on the bunk beds but this allows like an older kid to be on the bottom and then maybe the younger kid on the top this is perfect you know and this is all solid wood and this just came in this week and it's $849 now I've seen these as low as $599 when they get down on sale every year just to let you know now here's something new I've never seen them have here before. So this is the Pike and Main Boho Full Queen Headboard. This is really nice because it's like all carved out of wood. And this is meant to work with a standard metal bed frame. You just attach the bed frame right to it like this. So this is coming in, this just hit the floor this week at $400. And it's a Death Star deal, folks. This right here is the Universal Broadmoor Jayla Nightstand. So this is $349 dovetail see that this is what I look for in all drawers you always want to look for the dovetail wood because that means it's very well constructed you don't ever want to see just like a couple of brad nails or something like that so these look really nice very nicely done and you know I'm attention to detail here so when you look in the back there's actually a couple of USB outlets on the back that's pretty nice too and these come in at three hundred and fifty dollars but wait, there's more because they also have the matching Universal Broadmoor Jayla Tall Chest. And I love these handles on this. This has a real good, this kind of looks like, uh, yeah. so they sort of look like oil bronze to me. And I, I like the trim on the drawers, very classy. And again, just like the smaller ones, you get the dovetail construction, the ball bearing rollers, very nice, solid wood. Of course, you get your birch veneers on there. Oh, and this one has adjustable levelers too. Now this one has a little bit of a steeper price at $1,000. I'm willing to bet this thing goes on sale $150 or $200 off. You should expect to see this thing at around $800. And then here, the same thing, we have the dresser is $599, so about $600. So if you wanted to redo somebody's bedroom with this, you're looking at about $2,000 total. Not bad, 1,000 for that. 600 for that you're at 1600 and then the smaller night table you'd probably want to get two of those over there the shorter ones so now if you really want to bring your bedroom home now 
they have the king size and the queen size bed version now what i like about this is again nice it's modern and sleek and simple yet this kind of crown molding top makes it look very classy and the wainscoting kind of um, molding that goes around here makes it look really classy too breaks up the monotony of a just a simple minimal design and then of course you have the drawers here the drawers are not soft clothes those would go at the foot of the bed and so the queen sized version of this comes in at a thousand dollars and the king size version of this bed here at Costco comes in at eleven hundred and forty nine dollars so if you have your heart set on this I would definitely start keeping an eye on it and watching for the price drops. And sometimes they'll do it as a flash sale too that only lasts like a week or two. So we'll keep you up to date on that if we see anything. But anyway, my suggestion is always buy a king size bed whenever you can. If you have husband and wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, or whatever, make sure you get a king size bed. A queen is just not going to cut it. I just noticed that they just brought this out on the floor about five minutes ago. So it is uh, just put together and great quality. That's a good find, Gene. So if you f folks remember our friend Gene from Gigi Goes Keto, but he changed the name of his channel, so it's now called... Gigi Cooks Healthy Meals. Yeah, so I'm gonna put a link to Gene's uh, channel down in the video description, and you guys go check that out. He has a lot of great videos and cooking recipes, healthy cooking. Now we got this Craft and Main Brantley nine-piece dining set. They always get some big kind of a premier set that they have every year, and this one is... $1,399. Okay, now Costco kind of lost me here a little bit on this one. This is that Bayside Furnishings Brin five-piece dining set. I like the table. Table is maybe a little bit of a loud grain for me for a dining, but I'm not a fan of these chairs. I gotta tell you, I don't like this design, the shape, everything about it. I've never liked this type of chair. Just reminds me of a cheap bar chair in the 1970s. So this doesn't really do much for me. Okay, so now they've got these table lamps. It's a set of two for $139. Um, price is okay. I just don't like the design. That, that doesn't do anything for me. This is that cheap kind of gold metal stuff that was popular in the showers back in the 1980s. And these also just came in too. These are the Bridgeport Designs Austin Table Lamp 2-pack. These are 139. They look nicer and more modern, but I'm still not quite sold on that stem. It's like some kind of clear plastic. Let us know down in the comments below. What do you guys think about these lamps? Do you like either one of these, the gold one? or the clear plastic, let us know in the comments. I'd like to hear from you on that one. This right here is a beauty of an accent console right here. This is from Foremost Home. This is the Huntington 70 inch console. So this would sit right below, like for example, your TV on the wall. And I like these handles. These are very classy. I like the darker wood. And of course the dovetail design looks like the bearings on the, there. It's not soft clothes. Probably not as important as it would be in the kitchen. I think these doors are probably soft clothes. Yeah, they, those are. So there you can store all sorts of stuff down there for your TV. You can store all of your dining linens in there. And I like this classy cutout here on the end. So it almost gives you like a, sort of like a faux column. And then they translate that right up here to the top. So this is $700, but again, I'm willing to bet this drops $100 if it goes on sale. And here we have the 72 inch Ashland console, which has uh, glass doors on it. And these are pretty sure those are soft clothes. And same with that door there. I like that, it's a door that looks like drawers. And this seasonal Death Star deal is $550. So here's the Harlow 56 inch three in one TV stand. I like this one if you're looking for minimal stuff and it's dark and the glass and everything kind of stays out of the way. It doesn't attract too much attention to itself and you can hang your TV right above it. That way you don't have to deal with mounting your TV on the wall. And I'm liking this price here at $199.99, 200 bucks. Here you have the Craft and Main Ashwood 70 inch accent console. This one doesn't quite grow on me like the other one does. This seems a little bit older and stuffier to me. This is something that I think uh, maybe our grandparents would like. I doubt this would appeal to too many of the younger people. Now each year here at Costco, we usually get at least one or two different ones in, like uh, the longer one and the shorter one. So this one right here is the 74 inch fireplace console. So this right here comes with a two in one electric fireplace and a fan. And then of course your TV could just sit right up on top here. 
Here's how they're showing it on the box. And there it is in action right there. And this is a great way at $600 for those of us who live in Florida here to enjoy a little fireplace without having a chimney. Plus a lot of cities don't like you burning wood anymore. They usually have this desk here every year. It's very sleek and very modern. It's an adjustable height desk, electrically controlled. And it's actually done by right here by all your touch controls on the glass. So this Trasanti adjustable height desk is $300. And then we have a more classic style pedestal desk. This is the foremost Windview 60 inch writing desk and it's $549. So you can see there's a couple of outlets and a couple of USB ports on the back of it. And there's where it plugs in. And here's the Bayside Furnishings. This is their Aeron wannabe chair. Probably nowhere near as good as the Aeron chairs, which I own one. I've had it for probably over 20 years now. But this is $109, a heck of a lot cheaper than the $600 I paid for my Aeron chair. Those were all the rage back in the internet bust back in 2000. So this is pretty good here. This, they have a lot here. This is the Bayside Furnishings Ashland four-piece sofa table. So it's got the table with the three stools and you would put that probably right behind your couch. See how they show it right here on the box. And there's your dimensions for it. And that's actually a pretty decent price at $480. And what makes this really convenient too is you got two outlets and three USBs right there to charge your phones and stuff. And just very classy and yet very modern. I like this. I love this because it also doubles as counter height dining for you as well. See, you could sit right behind your couch and still facing the TV and still eat very comfortably there. I like that. It's a great way to have a few more people sit and enjoy a show or a game or something. And they're finally getting the Ove Vanities back in stock. I've loved these Ove Vanities that they've sold here at Costco the last three years or so and this one's the Layton 36 inch and what I like about all of their stuff is everything is soft clothes and there's no fake drawer in the front see look nice good quality wood and it comes with the top already and the sink so the only thing you need to do is go find your own faucet and your own drain they give you this second shelf here and it's cut around the p-trap so you have the extra storage space that you don't find in any other vanities and I also love that the back is completely open so that you have much better easier access at the wall and the plumbing if you ever have to fix anything everything here is wood do that solid wood frame everything is dovetail joints these just came in so they're not on sale yet they're $529 so hold off a month or so see if they drop the price any usually they'll come down 50 or $100 and of course every year right after Christmas they always set up the big huge floor display of the mattresses so here you have the Casper 12 inch memory foam king mattress this is only good until January 8th, so I think this might actually be a flash sale. So this one right here is $200 off down to $700. Okay, so that one was the king size mattress. So now here we have the queen size, and of course it's going to be a little bit cheaper. So this one is $150 off down to $550. And here's a good one because we hardly ever see the toppers here, folks. This is the queen size from tempur and this is great for college students. So if you have anybody that's going off to college in June, you better get them one of these now while they're still available. Sometimes you can't find these in a lot of stores. So this is $40 off down to $129. So in the dorms, they use these to put on top of those crappy mattresses that are there in the bunk beds. So a lot of students prefer to have these on there. If you're a little more. And then here they have the king size version of this also, the Tempur-Pedic. And this one is $50 off down to $139. Now you're not likely to have a king size bed and a dorm. You're probably going to have a full size, maybe a queen if you're lucky. Or, but if you're in an apartment and you're renting an apartment near the campus, now here you've got this Serenity pillow by Tempur-Pedic. It's a little on the firmish side. I prefer firm myself. Some people don't. Some people like the down. But this one here, it's not on sale, but it's still a pretty good price, $29.99. I gotta tell you, we were in Bed Bath & Beyond this morning and we were looking at down pillows that were $180 over there. Dang, I'm telling you, the prices are getting out of control at some of the retail box stores. So here's a pretty good whopping deal of a sale here. This is that Echelon EX-4S Plus. This is the bike. And when you, of course, normally when you buy these at Costco, they come with a one-year premium membership. But this one here, look at this, $300 off. 
down to 499 and this is awesome this is one of those rare big ticket items here at costco that hits the floor already on sale they just brought this in i was in here on christmas eve and they were just setting these up so this is the inspire fitness fts functional trainer with the bench built into it there's your cables there you can do everything chest curls i was just at the gym this morning doing these exercises for my chest i was doing all the chest exercises today and I use these a lot for doing the curls as well. Now, this one is $300 off down to $11.99. That's an incredible score. And it really doesn't take up a lot of footprint space either. This is great if you have room in your garage. So my friend Scott has something like this in his garage. When I was visiting him out in Newport Beach, California, we worked out in his garage a couple of months ago. This is the Proform Sport RL Rower for my fit comes in a box this big it's not on sale yet but i bet it will be soon so 499 dollars i'm willing to bet that they drop that price 50 to 100 dollars if it goes on sale keep your eye out on it finally they get some good brand name stuff this is that bowflex 5.1s stowable bench so this thing here flattens down as you can see here on the diagram on the side of the box it all folds right down and you can probably slide it under your bed or store it in a closet. Hey, and $200 is not a bad price at all for this. It will probably drop $30 to $50 if it goes on sale.